One common question that comes up in clinic is, will my spinal hardware set off the alarms at the airport? And I'd like to answer that question. Patients frequently ask, after a lumbar fusion or a cervical disc replacement or other implantation of spinal hardware, if they will have the alarms go off to the airport. First of all, I'm glad that so many of our patients are able to travel. I would like to travel myself a little bit more than I do. And I also find it a little bit interesting that this is such a common question. Sometimes it's like the first question people ask after we recommend a spinal fusion, for example. My answer is generally no. Most of the time, the spinal implants that we, that we place are not going to set off the alarms at the airport. They're primarily made of titanium and the bulk volume of metal in the implants is not particularly high. They're also deep in the body in most situations and we have rarely, if ever, heard reports of patients having their spinal hardware set off alarms at the airport. I do think, however, the hip replacement and the knee replacement implants can set off those alarms. And sometimes patients are given cards to explain that they have such an implant. We don't typically do that. I do think if that came up at the airport and somebody were to stop you, you could say, well, I had a fusion in my low back. Otherwise, I don't have any metal in my body or my person, and that should be uh, that should be satisfactory. But that question comes up a lot, so I thought I would address it. The answer again is no. The vast majority of spinal implants do not set off the alarms at the airport.